Hey everybody out there, it's me, Brian Polito, veteran publisher of Coffin Comics. And uh, I come to you before you to give you the State of the Union Coffin Comics style. First up, the thing you gotta know about our company is our mission statement. If you take a look at it, it's here, something that we kind of look at all the time, and it says we create fun, happiness, and excitement. And I will acknowledge to you that it really is a challenge, and it's been a challenge all week, reconciling being who we are as a company in the face of all the challenges that people are facing across the country and around the globe. I realize that in different areas people are being affected more than others and uh, our hearts go out to everybody. And I will let you know however that it is our game and in the face of it, even as I reconciled it, this is who we are for you. We do create fun, happiness, and excitement, but we don't want you to think that we're turning a blind eye to reality, and we're really clear on what's going on. Um, you know, a couple things that you need to know is Coffin Comics stands strong. Due to the fiends and the sworn, you have made us so mighty, and we are blessed. We are blessed by you. Uh, the other things that you need to know is that we are, at, at this point, I'm going to get into some of the things that the current stuff, but we will be complying with uh, our state's current laws in terms of no gatherings over 10. We haven't done that. And you will notice that we actually have a Kickstarter ending in about an hour, but we kind of muted it and we didn't do the normal shenanigans we would do. Like normally, by now, there'd be 50 people here. We'd be like drinking up like fools and go rah, rah, rah. And we just want to be respectful because we do realize that people across the globe, let's say in California, New York, uh, other countries are having a different experience right now, so we want to be respectful. Um, I want you to know again though that Coffin Comics is strong because of you guys and gals out there. We'll be obeying, uh, observing the law and uh, Coffin Comics will completely continue. Everything's fine and solid and we're going to do it uh, remotely. So Presidente Francisca Polito ironed it all out. And luckily, most of us can work remotely. Even our warehouse, we're actually gonna do it on shifts and we're gonna be using uh, people spacing and stuff like that. So I want you to know those things. A Couple other things I'd like you to know too, just in terms of updates. So as of about 10 minutes ago, uh, we shipped out Hell Witch Hellborn to you. Some, some of you guys and gals out there have seen some of the pictures that we've taken and posted. And that was uh, not Coffin Comics bragging, that was Coffin Comics showing you what we do, which is we are a uniquely Southwest American comic book publishing company. We are hardworking individuals and we're, we're determined by today to get Hell Witch out to you. Uh, a couple other notes. So uh, yeah, so Hell Witch is shipped. Um, the uh, Coffin Comic Con online Virtually all orders will be out as of tomorrow, with the exception of some of the signed live selling and remarks from Mike DiBalfo, Monty Moore, and Murat Michaels. But the good news is all of those are in process. Murat signed his books today, DiBalfo's coming in tomorrow, and we're getting the stuff over to Monty. Um, Lady Death, Malevolent Decimation has been a wild campaign. Love it, and it closes in an hour. Again, normally you'd see us like you know, but again, I do want to be respectful in the face of what's going on and, uh, you know, the ever-changing, ever-evolving circumstance. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, while we're here, hey man, let's get into some show and tell. First up, I would like to welcome you officially to your new Goodwill Ambassador, Mr. Bob Cronister. Now, I verbally... Uh, Acknowledged Bob as the uh, Goodwill Ambassador about a month ago, but here is the actual uh, certificate that he will be receiving soon. So look, when times are tough, Bob is a great guy to speak to. What I love and adore about Bob is uh, he's a tough, no BS guy, but he has a heart of gold. And I really admire that about him. He also is just a He's a loving man who really is a great representative of the Fiends and the Sworn Nation. So, if times get tough, also feel free to reach out to Bob, because Jesus, he could, he could make anybody's day a better day. Thank you, Bob. Thank you for uh, accepting that uh, solemn, solemn duty. Uh, next up, fun. Uh, look, Coffin Don't Play. So, 
nothing's changed in ter terms of how we operate, what we intend to unveil. And I got to tell you, and excuse me for my excitement, but we really have exciting things to unveil to you in the immediate future. So one of the things I'd like to show you, and some I can't talk about, but they're going to be cool. But something I can show you is I already just got some proofs in on malevolent decimation. And so this is a cover proof, and that shows some of the the foil logos that we're doing on the main edition. This is actually, um, so this is a proof of the interior and then this is the uncut signature. So each one of these things is called a signature and when they're bound and glued, in our case, perfect bound, they will we'll make up the 48 page book. It's, the whole book is 48 pages. So this is before it's trimmed. And then a couple more covers. So this is the hard cover, and this will the hard cover cover. Um, this is the black out, blackened edition, and then finally, this is what we would call the base for the metal edition. It doesn't have coating so that that metal can affix really nicely on there. So those are some things that are going on. So. You know, at a time like this, I ask myself, you know, what do I expect of myself and what, what do I hope for others? And what I do every time is I ask myself, this is what I ask myself. I said, what would this guy do? So I look at a guy like Captain America, my hero, and I think that he is strong, he is resilient, he is uh, problem solving, but he's also kind. So what I like to say that I'm going to be a stand for in this matter is that Coffin Comics is going to continue to bring fun, happiness, and excitement. Even in the face of all of our challenges, I believe that we, humanity, is resilient. We will overcome. I know that we have challenges in front of us, but I know that I'm going to ask myself every day to kind of look at how can I help. Uh, I was out one afternoon earlier in the week, and there was a woman, clearly in her 90s, and a very, very long line for food as, as, it, as it is right now. And people were so kind, you know, they moved that lady right up to the front and then people helped her through. That was cool. And I think in a time like this, uh, this speaks to our better self. So that's my commitment. I wanna see if there's anything else that I wanted to say. Yeah, I would say that, you know, fundamentally, I just have an optimistic view of the world and I know our challenges are in front of us. So what I wanna say in conclusion is, thank you so much everybody for your support of Coffin Comics. Coffin Comics, plans to be there for you by being entertaining and being a stand for happiness and optimism. Uh, I, would like, I would say, what I like to say is like, be smart, be strong, be prepared, but, of all, but, but above all, be kind. So you guys have been great. I've been Brian Polito. I will be speaking to you much sooner than you would expect and the shenanigans will, will never stop. So talk soon. Have a great weekend, everybody. And thank you so much for everything and feel free to reach out. Have a great day. Thank you.